Welcome Crossroads family to another week of Crossroads Connect. We've done some crazy things in this segment, everywhere from eating spicy hot pepper peanuts to just hanging out and talking, going through our church app. So if you've been with us these past few weeks, we're glad to have you back. If you're new, we're so glad you're with us. Be sure to subscribe to our channel so that you're always up to date on the latest videos. Click that notification bell so that you're the first to know when we have new content out. We're excited this week to talk about something very special, very near and dear to Crossroads Heart, which is our kids. So our kids ministry, while it's looked very different in this past season, is still alive and well, and they are doing the best they can to reach our kids and families here at Crossroads. So we have an exciting event coming up, and I have a special guest here to join me to tell you all about it. Here with me, I have a very special human who is amazing, talented, loves the Lord, and she's here to uh, give you some great news about an exciting event that's coming up. But before we do that, please introduce yourself to everybody and tell us what you do here at Crossroads. Oh, and that's Carter. Got he joined me. us. <laughs> you can't see him, but um, he's there. <laughs> so I am Michaela Credit, and I am the administrator for the children's department, and I'm also a division leader for um, our kids' church area when we have Kids Church on Sundays, which we don't right now, but when we have Kids Church on Sunday, that's where you'll find me on the weekends. Awesome. And so how long have you and your family been here at Crossroads? So I have been here with my family for six and a half years. Um, my husband has been here for about 13 years. So awesome. long time. <laughs> so they're Crossroads originals. I love it. That's awesome. So tell us, um, why is the kids ministry so important to you as obviously someone who works in it, who's hands on, but then also someone who's a mom and who has a family? Yeah. So the kids ministry is really important to me because I just love seeing little kids learn who Jesus is. Um, and Pastor Bill, my boss, one of his favorite statistics is that um, a kid is foundational in their faith and what they're going to believe as an adult is like already solidified by the age of 12. Mm -hmm. So I really think that where we are in kids ministry, teaching kids that Jesus loves them and not that just that Jesus loves them, but who he can be to them in their everyday life is just really important. And so I love that I get to do that every day, week in and week out. That's amazing. That's awesome. So obviously this season has looked a little or a lot different <laughs> yep. for our kids ministry. And so um, what have you done during this quarantine time with the kids? Yeah, so every single weekend we have two videos. We have videos for our toddlers through kindergarten students, and then we have videos for our kids' church kids. So they're filmed every single week. You'll see a lot of my face and some of our other um, kids' church workers, and then we put it together with a lot of the curriculum that we use. We have a really great curriculum, um, so they give us worship songs and things like that. So we've been having videos every single week. It's amazing. I love it. I love it. So tell us, what is the exciting event coming up this September, this coming month for the kids and the families? So we are having what we're calling the Back to School Bash. It's going to be on September 20th, which is a Sunday at 4 o'clock. You need to make sure you register online. The event for you to register is already up on the website, um, or I believe you could see it in your church app currently. Um, so what it is going to be, it's going to be an in-person live service for you as an adult or a guardian to come with your kids church kids we're gonna have live worship games we're gonna have a bible story um, you're gonna see a lot of familiar faces your kids are gonna be able to see their friends um, so it's just gonna be a family fun event for the kids to come and have a service of their own which they haven't had in a long time um, so we're really excited about it i cannot wait to see your kiddos faces because i miss them so <laughs> Amazing. And um, what are kind of the protocols or things that we're... Carter, you want to be a part of the video? Join us. What are some of the uh, protocols or things that we're doing for this event to keep safe and to keep everybody following the, the certain guidelines that we have? Yeah. So the reason why we're having a registration is so that we can make sure that the numbers are going to be under 100. Um, and if there needs to be a second service, we're going to add a second service at some point, but we're going to see how it, the registration goes so far. Everybody is going to be required to wear a mask. So everybody over the age of four 
is going to be required to wear a mask just as they would be in normal service. You're going to be seated six feet apart from each other just as you would be in normal service. So all the protocols that we would follow on a weekend service or a youth service would be um, in place at the event. Awesome. Well, it sounds like it's going to be an amazing time. We're so excited to be able to offer this to our families. And if you are out there and you have a family, come join us. It's going to be amazing. Sunday, September 20th at four o'clock. Be sure to register online and get there nice and early. And we're going to have such an amazing time. And we hope to see you there. Go. Oh. Jesus is alive. No. He's not. Fifteen five at the water fell. Don't give the the